first of all let us understand how it reads the data from the excel irrespective of whether it is xls or xlsx how your apache pui try to get the information from your excel file okay so let's have a look on that first this is very important here i have an excel file with the name called tested data right and in this excel file or in this workbook i have multiple sheets i have sheet 1 sheet 2 and sheet 3 and i will be having a sheet 4 sheet 5 or we can name that sheet also okay so assume that assume that so generally leave about testing perspective just i want to ask you to read the data from this cell from this cell so what are the things i need to or what is what are all the information i need to provide so that you can access or you can reach to this particular cell first of all i need to provide where my excel sheet is located in which drive okay and what is the name of it Yes or no? This is very much common. First, where is my Excel sheet located? Okay. And uh, what is the name of that Excel file? Whether it is XLSX or XLSX. So that I need to provide first. This is the first point. After that, again, I need to provide where, in which sheet my data is. Because once you open this test data workbook or test data file, so you'll be getting multiple sheets under it like we have sheet one, sheet two and sheet three. So definitely I need to provide which sheet you need to open up. So sheet three. So first workbook location and the name of the workbook is the first part. Next, accessing the sheet. Okay, so once you open sheet three, then we have data in terms of cells. Okay, so if I ask, if I want to ask you to get the data from this particular cell, okay? So what information I need to provide? I need to information give the provide information of row and column. Row and column makes the cell. So I need to say third row, E column, third row, E column. Then you'll be able to access that particular data. Correct? Okay. Same like that. Assume that I want to give you a task so that you need to read the data from this particular cell. So what are all I need to provide? First, I need to provide your excel file location and as well as name of the file and then sheet name next which row it is it is row one okay and column c row one and column c right so that you'll be able to access that if i provide all this information to you same like that okay if you want to ask tool to access this particular cell so definitely you need to provide all this information to the tool also first workbook next sheet next row next column okay and the very important point here two important points you need to notice see without accessing workbook you can't access the sheet directly you can't access the sheet first you need to get the access to the workbook then we need to access to the sheet means what does it mean your workbook contains sheets now your sheet 3 contains rows rows okay so without accessing sheets three or any sheet you can't access row directly if i say row two without accessing sheet your system may ask you like which row because you have multiple sheets on which sheet you want to access the row yes or no okay that is point one next see without accessing row we can't access columns so what does it mean sheet contains rows your sheet contains rows rows contains columns rows and columns make the cell okay so without row without giving the information of row directly we can't access the whole column it is not possible okay column is a property of row this is important that you will understand as you progress but remember that okay these are all the information what we need to provide to access the data okay now apache pio is one and even see generally to work with java okay so we need to give access to the workbook first 
So that happens using file input stream. You need to use a class called file input stream. Okay, so that will open this file internally so that we can start working on this file. Okay, so first we need to write file input stream, which will give access to the workbook. Then we need to use Apache PUI related jars or related script, and we'll be trying to access the data in your Excel sheet. So read and write. So two operations we are going to do, read the data from the Excel and write the data to the Excel. Okay, yes.